I want to take a few minutes to discuss many concerns that have been shared over the past several weeks. I've heard words like afraid, worried, and scared. I want you to know we're scared too. Every night I go to bed worrying about the possible outcomes and every morning I wake up and pray for guidance. Even with all of the uncertainty, I know this much is true. The single most important thing we will do this year is reopen our doors for our kids. On our first day of school, it will have been 157 days since we have had students and teachers in our schools learning, discussing, laughing and crying, and building relationships with one another. At this point, it has never been more clear how important a role our schools play in a healthy community. Without our schools, students can't build healthy relationships, and society suffers. Kids lose educational time, and the next generation suffers. Parents can't work, and the economy suffers. We are living in a moment where fear is everywhere. It has invaded our thoughts, it has influenced our decisions, and it has clouded our judgment. I've watched people spend tremendous amounts of energy trying to tear others down, taking shots on social media, and judging those that disagree. These actions are about stoking fear and winning an argument. And that's not what we are about. John Meacham once wrote, fear is about limits, hope is about growth. Fear pushes away, hope pulls others closer. Fear divides, hope unifies. Those words have resonated with me. We can't allow fear to prevent us moving forward. We must embrace hope as the antidote to fear. So how do we move forward? We offer a hand and lift each other up. We use social media to remind people about the efforts and accomplishments of our students and staff. And we spend time understanding why others think differently. These types of engagements are about hope, empathy, and love. And that is what the Boise School District is about. All of us have students, family, and friends who work in or attend our schools. We would never put anyone into a situation that we don't feel is as safe as possible. I've never been prouder than I am today. I've never been more hopeful. And on August 17th, the Boise School District will reopen. Whether it is in person or virtually, we will be open. We will return. Obviously, the next few weeks will determine how that looks, but please know that for months we have spent time working with health experts, teachers, parents, and community leaders. Through these efforts, we have developed organizational strategies that make it possible for us to provide meaningful learning to almost 26,000 students. I know the plans we have in place will work to keep everyone as safe as possible when we open our doors. But remember, at some point, we must trust in one another and together step across the threshold. When that happens, it will be driven by our district and school reopening plans, our district values, and our belief in you. I know that when we are unified, we can do hard things. So please, when you have questions or concerns, reach out to your school administrators so that we can maintain open communication. In addition, wash your hands, wear a mask, and respect physical distancing because these are the only things that each and every one of us can control. And at this point, it's the only way out of the situation that we find ourselves in. Thank you for your time and please stay healthy.